Hello Libra and welcome to your tarot reading. We are going to look at your energies for the second half of September, September 16th through 30th. And I just want to say happy birthday to all of my September Libras. I hope you all have magical birthdays and may all of your birthday wishes come true. So let's get in Libra. What is happening for you guys second half of September? So we have watching, <clears throat> unrealistic expectations, inform yourself, revealing dreams, and universal favor. All right, Libra. Wow, and look at, think twice, and surprising news, okay. So Libra, there is something that you have been wanting here. And as a general reading, obviously you all want different things, but apply this to where what you want is like there, but it evades you in some capacity, okay? And what I'm getting is the second half of September, if you, really just go into more of an observation mode, you know, especially if this involves another person. If you go into observation mode and really separate yourself from your wants, desires, expectations, and any emotional attachment you have to a person or a situation here, you're going to start to see a whole different picture emerge, okay? Because with unrealistic expectations, what that tells, and sitting right next to inform yourself, okay, that's telling me that there's something that's kind of hidden from you or something that you're not seeing about a person, a situation, or a choice that you're trying to make here, okay? And see, the Spirit's saying, um, think twice because with surprising news, there's more that will be revealed, okay? So something that you're looking at that seems like it's what you want, Spirit's saying you actually don't, okay? And revealing dreams, um, your spiritual team has been trying to give you insight and clarity about this through your dreams and showing you the truth about things, okay? And this universal favor is I'm seeing like whatever it is that you, you're trying to reach for here, you're being divinely protected. You're being divinely guided away from it. There's something better for you, Libra. Again, this could be about a choice, about something you want, about a situation, or about a very specific person. You know your life. You know what you're going through at this time. So apply it where it fits. And if it doesn't fit, then, you know, don't make it. It's okay um, if, you know, this isn't your reading. But for those Libras that this is resonating, I'm telling you, there is something you don't know or all of the information isn't out in the open. And um, that's why it, <clears throat> it doesn't seem like what you're reaching for can't seem to happen or you can't seem to make a choice <clears throat> or it's just like right out of your grasp, out of your reach. And yeah, uh-uh. You don't want it. I know it seems like you do, but by the end of September, you're going to know a truth about something here or the information is going to reveal itself because it says inform yourself. And so with watching unrealistic expectations and inform yourself, that's why I'm saying really pull back and do your best to separate yourself from what it is that you're hoping for because when that's the overriding factor, then that's when we have the rose-colored glasses on, okay? And this is Spirit saying, really separate yourself from your emotions, from your desires about this, and you're going to see the real picture. And through <clears throat> seeing the real picture, Libra, you're like, okay, yeah, no, absolutely not. And some of you have had dreams, like, it's the truth of things. And even if you like have confronted somebody, they're like, no, no, but absolutely, yeah. All right, let's pull.
Hooks and Tarot. Let's put this up there. Mm-hmm. Five of Swords, Defeat. See, Spirit's trying to protect you from something, telling you you really don't want this or there's a better way. Um, yeah. See, what, what this is, Libra, it's not up to your energy. It's not aligned to your vibration. It would only bring defeat. And you coming through as the Emperor means um, like you know being strong being stable being in control being a leader being abundant all of those things to proceed into this whatever this is for you would actually bring great defeat to this emperor energy Six of Cups and it says pleasure here. So it's definitely something that you feel would make you happy. It's something you feel that you want. Yeah, Abundance, Three of Cups and uh, Luxury, Four of Cups. Okay. So lots of Cups energy. Four of Cups is, you know, <clears throat> a disappointment, right? It's like, oh, why does it have to be this way? I'm over this energy. And if also Libra, if somebody tries to come back into your life over these next two weeks, really take a step back from it and <clears throat> observe that person and look at things very realistically. Okay, because again, I just... What I'm getting about all of this is it's like a no. You don't want this. You don't want, um, you know, this choice. You don't want this person, this situation, all right? Or somebody trying to come back in. It's like you don't, you don't want that. You might think you do, but Spirit wants to show you everything that's under the surface, okay? And I'm telling you, Libra, you guys are having some dreams that are telling you the truth. All right, we have temperance. Yeah, trying to keep you in a balanced, stable place, saying this, what you're asking for would actually make you unhappy, even though it doesn't appear that way in this moment. Let's see what else. Four of Wands, yeah. See, um, temperance, balance. Four of Wands, stability. Two of Pentacles. So the dream you have, you definitely feel like there is something to it, but you're like, oh, it's just a dream, you know? Libra, just, <clears throat> you know, it is a dream. Don't base your life choices on it, right? But just take into account what is revealed there to you because there is some truth coming through in your dream where um, that's the easiest way for your spirit guides to connect with you and to communicate with you about whatever this is for you personally, okay? So there is truth coming through in the dreams, and you are, your spirit is trying to divinely protect you, and some things, you know, even though they look like they're good, they're not, but you're going to know, like you're going to find out.
Okay, Nine of Swords. Nine of Wands. And the Magician. Okay, this is the surprising news. See, it's like um, where something you you think you were fearing, but I feel you were feeling intuitively. You're realizing um, the truth here. And because of this coming out like this, I know that whatever this is for you personally, you do have some sort of intuition about it, especially those of you that are having these dreams. Like, you just know something is off, something is hidden, there's just something that doesn't sit right. But you can't, you know, confirm it. You can't validate it. You can't put your finger on it, maybe. And so you you think that maybe, okay, I'm just in my emotions or I'm just being paranoid or um, I'm just overthinking things. No, you're definitely getting an intuition about something here. And you need to, to really trust that. And it's like once it's all revealed... You're going to be like, I'm psychic. <laughs> I'm deeply spiritually gifted. Just because of how in tune you have been, okay, with the energy. But, um, you know, when we're emotionally involved or we really want something, it can cloud and distort our vision and our intuition, right? So let's see what your angels have to say about this. <clears throat> you know you can do it. Your family needs you right now. Call upon your angels to give you strength. And your angels will only give you the challenges that you are capable of handling. All right. In this situation, Libra, you're growing. You're growing spiritually, emotionally, and mentally Okay, because like I said, you feel this somehow, some way within you. You absolutely do. You might not be able to validate or quite put your finger on what's wrong, but you just know the energy, it's not balanced. And separate yourself from it and then look at the situation. And you're just gonna you're gonna see the truth for what it is. Which ultimately I feel even though you were hoping for one thing, once everything's out in the open, you're feeling more relieved. Like, okay, yeah, I'm glad that didn't happen because that would have really screwed up my happiness in my life. Like, this isn't, it's not what I thought it was. So just keep that in perspective, Libra. Spirit is really trying to protect you from something here. And it's not one of those things where you have to go on for years just questioning and wondering why. You're going to know why very soon. And from that uh, knowledge coming forth, then you feel relieved that it just didn't happen. It didn't work out. All right. So those are your messages, Libra. I'm sending you lots of love and light. Take care.